plants in our practice today are placed in a guided manner. What does that mean? Unlike the past where, you know, the surgeon would open the area to place the implant and hopefully find some bone there and place the implant eyeballing perhaps where the implant needs to be. Today, we take extra precautions so we have more favorable, more predictable outcomes. So what we use here, this is a software where we start with the end in mind. In other words, this person is missing this white tooth. We're gonna place the ideal white tooth in, its, in, the, in the place of the missing tooth right here. Once we have that, then we're gonna plan an implant that appropriately supports that tooth in the proper angulation. So that gives the surgeon not only an, out, an outline of where the implant is to be, because we can superimpose the actual radiograph of the bones of that person, but even better, even better yet, this information can be transferred then to our own 3D printer. And you can see here, this is a screen that shows us exactly the surgical guide that needs to be printed in order for that implant to go exactly where it needs to go. So that creates accountability from the surgeon to the patient, from the surgeon to the restorative doctor. And we're making sure that all our implants are placed in an ideal position so we don't have issues that have to do with hygiene, aesthetics, and so on and so forth. Now our 3D printer basically makes the surgical guide that I showed you out of resin, and it's gonna start printing the 3D uh, guide right now, which I'm gonna utilize during surgery after we disinfect it. And the 3D guide is gonna look kind of like this, similar to this. So the implants will be placed exactly where they need to be. And that is how we are accountable for perfect results every time.